Shalom, Shalom, Call Halal Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwe Dash. Double honors to the elders and to the elder apostles of Great Millstone that taught me this word in all truth and sincerity. Salutations to you, Akiyam, out there on the highways and the byways, risking, their, risking your lives and your freedom to seal the 144,000 elect. Salutations to the hopeful elect. Salutations to you, Akiyam and Akwaf, that be known as the speckled birds, the Israelite foreigners, because your forefathers mingled with the heathen nations across the four corners of the earth, wherever you were scattered to. And a strong shalom to the Akwaf, sitting and listening in silence, as the scriptures say to do so. This is your brother, Amoth Ya'ais from Yahawada. Amoth Ya'ais from Yahawada. Coming at y'all with another lesson in the spirit. Uh, I was watching the brothers in Chicago uh, last night and the subject matter of the Edomite child uh, had uh, basically had surfaced in the lesson. And uh, we were basically talking, well, the brothers was basically talking about uh, how Jake is uh, trying to resemble the Edomite children, how they act towards their parents and how they are totally dis disrespectful, disobedient, out of course, out of order, whatever term you want to use, they are completely abominable, abom abominable, okay? Uh, so, uh, and uh, the, I saw this movie that, uh, that you, you brothers probably saw this movie or probably watched it before, probably even heard about it, uh, Problem Child, okay? Now, f before I go on further, let me put this up. The Fair Use Act, okay? Uh, YouTube. I will not be using this to profit any money to gain any type of... Uh, uh, any, uh, any type of uh, the Federal Reserve notes at all. This is specifically and only for the use of teaching, for the use of to gain knowledge, okay? And I just want to make that clear. So, uh, as I just stated, brothers and sisters, uh, the the conversation that came up about uh, uh, the so called uh, so called black, so called Hispanic, so called Native and Seminole uh, Indian uh, children, which are the twelve tribes of Israel, uh, uh, mirroring uh, the children of of uh, Esau Edom, and as you can see in this picture right here, you can see a. Uh, a, a little Eve and a, a Eve in the back that's actually trying to mingle with the heathens. Uh, so without further ado, let's go ahead and, head and uh, pull out the few precepts that I have for this lesson. And one just came to mind that I'm going to bring out that I, did, that I didn't actually pull up, but I'll see, I'll see if I can bring it out. Okay, this is Psalms chapter 58, verse 3, and it reads this. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. Okay. And I'll let the, uh, the video play so you can get more of a, a insight of uh, why I brought these certain precepts out for this video. And uh, like I said, if you've watched this movie before or if you heard about this movie or whatever the case may be, I'm very certain that you can make a whole lesson out of the whole movie, okay? Okay, so let's go to... Uh, let's jump to this one. Uh, this is Proverbs chapter 12, and this is verse 22, and it reads this. Lying lips are an abomination to the power of Yahweh, but they that deal truly are his delight. Delight. Now, we know as uh, elder, elder, uh, elder teacher and elder brother uh, Malcolm has, has said and stated plenty of times that, uh, that E will tell you one, one true fact. And then he'll just add on two, two or more lies on top of that. Uh, this this man, this base, this basis of man cannot tell the truth to save his life. OK, the truth is not in him. He, he, he was made to be the wicked. He was made to be uh, un, unjustifiable, you know, uh, to be. To be an abomination, man, he was just he was just made to, to just to go off on everything in life, man, everything. Righteousness is not in him. Uh, righteousness to him is, is to be wicked. That's righteous to him, okay? All right, so let's keep on going. 
and this is what this is what everybody is supposed to be doing to their children, uh, and, and very much including uh, the twelve tribes of Israel, because this is our book and this is our uh, uh, our laws and our commandments and our statutes that we're supposed to follow in this book to the best of our ability. Okay, uh, this is Proverbs chapter twenty three, and I'm gonna start at verse thirteen, and it reads this: Withhold not correction from the child, for if thou beatest him with the rod, he shall not die. 14. Thou shalt beat him with the rod and shalt deliver his soul from hell. And that's clear as day, man. You know, you got a lot of these uh, uh, a lot of these kids, uh, you know, especially E's kids. They, they run the household. But now you got Jake's uh, these these Jake kids doing the same thing that the E kids is doing. You know, uh, uh, cussing out their parents, telling their parents what they want, and they better do this and they better do that, and and threatening with threatening their parents that they're gonna call the police and CPS on them and everything else that they can uh think of just to you know get their way and and, and to control the household, man. And that also falls into uh, let me see. Uh, no, it's in Isaiah. I think it's thirteen, if I'm not mistaken, y'all. Sharala. Uh, no, you know what? Slakia. Yeah. I think it's in three, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's in Isaiah three. Yeah, yep, it's right here. Isaiah chapter three and verse 12, and it reads this. As for my people, children are their oppressors, and women rule over them. O oh, my people, they which lead the, the cause thee to err and destroy the way of thy paths. Let me read that again. As for my people, children are their oppressors and women rule over them. O oh, my people, they which lead thee cause thee to err and destroy the way of thy paths. Now, you got these uh these uh so-called black, so-called native, seminal and so-called Hispanic uh, women talking about you know the 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 men ain't nothing the men ain't the men ain't uh, s s i s i s h i t you know but uh, little do you know y'all been raising these men to not be nothing so you know you you've you been booting the man out of the household to to basically uh, let let your so-called white daddy uh, tell you what to do and just because he gives you a little bit of power you've been you you you, you basically you you are our enemy man and you basically destroying your own nation without uh, uh the so-called uh, uh white man doing it you you basically you be, you you was pit bull you was guard dog you helping him do his dirty work and you're gonna be punished for everything that you're doing against your own nation man that's why two-thirds of our people are going to have a, tra a, a, a a tragic horrific death man okay all right let's go to psalms uh chapter 52 and i'm gonna start at verse 2 and it reads this thy tongue this divisive mischief like a sharp razor working deceitfully thou lovest evil more than good and lying rather than to speak righteousness salah thou lovest all devouring words o thou deceitful tongue who the hell is this who, who is this you should know you should you should already know you should already know this 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 uh uh, uh chapter in, in in Psalms, man. And who the hell is talking about, man? This is this is powerful, man. Let me read this again, starting at verse two. Thy tongue deceiveth mischief, like a sharp razor, working deceitfully. Thou lovest evil more than good, and lying rather than rather than to speak righteousness. Salah. Thou lovest all devouring words, O thou deceitful tongue. Man, oh man. Let me see if I can find this other, other precept I wanted to put down. I forgot to pull it up. It just came to me before when I started the lessons. So Salakia, Yasharala. Yep, pull it right up right there. Job, uh, Job chapter 30, verse 8. Thy, they were children of fools, ye children of base men. They were valor than the earth. And that's what the and that's what these uh these damn demons are. You're base men, you're valor than the earth, and you're fools, man. You really think that Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah is dealing with you, man. You really think that. But little did you know you're gonna find out he's not. 
So, you know, I, I could have brought out way more presets for this for this little uh, minute clip, but I'm going to go ahead and let this clip play. Uh, and uh, hopefully y'all be edified off of this. to be punished, so I'm going to take back your allowance. The whole buck? That's right, now. Just hand it over. I wonder if he's got change for a 20. Okay. I think you'd better go right to bed. Just use this time to think about what you've done and what you're going to do. You understand? I hope you've learned a lesson. Good night. What is this guy? Nice or something? Salaki so is right now. I want y'all to pay attention. I'm going to let it play one more time and then I'm going to close it out. I'm going to close it out. I want y'all to pay attention, man, to everything that this that this little demon is doing and everything, how, how, he, how, he, how he basically is playing. This, <laughs> man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. How he basically is playing his parents. And and little, little did they know the parents was doing the same thing when they was kids. And how, how basically, you know, in the beginning, the outfit that he had on, it matched his skin tone and everything. And then, you know, when he gave him the buck, he, he probably had more money in that drawer than that than his than his so-called father had in his have in his savings account. Okay? Now just just pay attention to every little detail in it in this clip, man. Perhaps this was the one step too far. This could be a problem. I think we've got a problem. Oh, you think we've got a problem? Well, you want to know what I think? I think we should get rid of the kid and buy a new cat. Flo, you're not making any sense. Oh, you want to make sense? Why don't you show him who's boss? Here, be a man. Please, God, I'm so sorry for what I've done. I won't ever do it again, I promise. And I don't ever want to cause Mr. Healy any trouble. He's the only one that's ever been nice to me. Please don't spank me, Mr. Healy. Boy, Junior, I don't want to, but you're going to have to be punished, so I'm going to take back your allowance. The whole buck? That's right, now. Just hand it over. I wonder if he's got change for a 20. to bed. Just use this time to think about what you've done and what you're going to do. You understand? I hope you've learned a lesson. Good night. What is this guy? Nice or something? Yeah, and there you have it, man. And this this is just a reminder, man. This is this is this is this is just a reminder, man, to, to everybody in Yasharala, man, that who, who, the type of people we dealing with, man. Even even as kids, as children, they already doing doing mischief and already got their hands hands to practice on how to continue to do their mischief to get more wiser and wiser at it. We know Esau is spiritually retarded, but Esau is not stupid, man. Okay, you, you, get that out your head. Esau is not stupid. Okay. 
Now, this, this is just a reminder to Yasharala, man, the 12 tribes of Yasharala, man, of who we dealing with. These, as soon as these people come out, come out of the box, man, they, they just wicked as hell. They, they just all automatically running into mischief, lying, and, and, and being so damn deceitful, man. Oh, we, oh, we, we have to be 10, 10 steps ahead of them, man, in everything that we do against them, man, in righteousness, man. So, you know, Yahweh Ratazah, this was edifying to y'all, and this will be a reminder to y'all not to trust none of them, okay? I don't, I don't give a shit if they six months. Don't trust don't test, trust none of them, okay? And uh, again, YouTube, this is under the Fair Use Act, Section 107 of the Copyright Act. This is sp specifically for teaching, okay? I'm not gaining no profit, no money off of this. This is for teaching, Okay? All right, so with that, I'm going to say, call hello, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, by Hashem, Rakakwadash, Wa, Abad, Babal, Shalom.